Hey, what's up guys? I'm Eric and today I'm going to talk to you about the top five questions I have about Star Wars The Force Awakens after seeing the movie. I'm going to go ahead and jump right into it. Starting at number five, will we see other factions of the Empire in future films? First Order might not be the only ones out there. Obviously it grew to be a large threat due to Snoke, Kylo Ren, and Starkiller base all huge major threats to the resistance. But what if there were other factions out there? What if they were fighting the First Order? Would they even possibly align themselves with the resistance to fight the First Order? How interesting would that be? I think it would be really cool for them to introduce a third party into the mix rather than just have your generic good versus evil. You know, just throw in somebody else, mix things up a bit. Then at number four, Will we see Maz Kanata again? She had a very specific interest in Rey throughout the movie, or in the short scenes that she was in. She mentioned to Rey that she knows the Force, but is no Jedi. In a deleted scene that JJ talked about, apparently Maz actually used the Force to crush a couple of stormtroopers that entered into her castle. Does she have some sort of connection to Luke? She has Luke's lightsaber. How did she get it? She just said, uh, that's a story for another time, Han. Then at number three, what are the Knights of Ren? We learned that Kylo Ren is the master of the Knights of Ren. So are they just dark side users? Are they Sith? Are they something new? Could any of them have also been Luke's apprentices? Did they help Kylo Ren destroy Luke's next generation of Jedi? Then coming in at number two, who really is Supreme Leader Snoke? Is he actually a Sith Lord? Possibly Darth Plagueis. According to Emperor Palpatine, Darth Plagueis could even keep the ones close to him from dying. Why not keep himself from dying? It would also explain why Snoke has been around for as long as he has. It doesn't explain why he didn't intervene during the times of the Empire and kill Palpatine and take over, but... Then at number one, you probably guessed it, who is Rey? Is she a Skywalker? Star Wars has been a story about the Skywalker family. Or is she complete, somebody completely new? Fan theories out there say that she could be born of the Force, just like Anakin was. Was she previously trained in the Force? How in the world was she able to beat Kylo Ren in a my mind probing competition. And then, later, in a freaking lightsaber duel, he was wounded though, so, you know, the bowcasters are really freaking powerful. If you didn't, complaining that Kelrin, oh, he's such a wuss for getting shot with a blaster and then not being able to fight afterward. Okay, let's see you get shot with a bowcaster and fight continuing on. But the biggest question about Rey right now is Luke her father. In one of the trailers, we hear Luke repeat his lines from episode 6. The force is strong in my family. I have it. My father had it. You have that power too. And I think that's in reference to Rey, not Kylo. Luke's lightsaber calls to Rey in Maz Kanata's castle, then shows Rey things that I believe were everything that happened to Luke. Shows him in Bepson, Cloud City, fighting Darth Vader. It also shows Luke put his hand on R2, and then followed by Kylo Ren appearing and striking somebody down, who I believe was probably a part of Luke's next generation of Jedi. And your Rey is seeing this from Luke's perspective, followed by Rey saying, no, don't go, Luke leaving her on Jakku. And lastly, the biggest piece of evidence that I think I could find at the end of the movie, Luke gets a little bit teary-eyed when Rey shows up and presents him with the lightsaber. Once he finally realizes who she is, he just can't accept that he had to leave his daughter behind. That is all I've got for today, guys. So hit me up in the comments. Let me know what you think the answer to these questions are. Do you agree with my theory about Luke being Rey's father? Let me know in the comments. Hey Internet, if you like this video, please like and subscribe down below and then check out the rest of my videos. Catch you guys later.